The ESP32 is, as Andreas Spies says in this fantastic video, everybody's darling. It is a chip that makers and engineers love alike, and as a content creator and tech journalist, I can't write about any other chip without, uh, yeah, people saying, why don't you use an ESP32? Now, uh, Andreas has just released a fantastic video saying, what do we do now? The ESP32 will eventually run out of uh, production, and what chip shall replace it? Spoiler alert, it's another ESP32. But yes, you're going to have to head to the link in our bio, or go to Andreas's channel to find out why. Um, if you're not a fan of Andreas Spies or already. He is uh, one of the most in-depth sort of Arduino-based YouTubers, although he does a lot more than just Arduino. Also, if you're interested in software-defined radio and all that kind of stuff, he has a second channel covering that kind of stuff too. Um, we will be uh, linking out to uh, both this channel and his other channel from our link tree. And uh, yeah, this is just, I've been a massive fan of Andreas for years. If you're not already watching his stuff and you are a maker, he covers the more technical side of stuff um, and does it in a way that is very easy to understand. I personally have learned a lot from Andreas and I think that you will too.